you can have anything you want any truck any trailer any type of equipment all you have to do is think positive it's called the power of positive thinking all you have to do is put it into the universe put it into your head and boom it becomes real is so I've been told it's a very interesting topic comment below and tell me what you think about that topic uh, it's interesting because it came up before um, someone told me this someone told me hey all you have to do is use the power of positive thinking and you can have anything you want any outcome any account that you want to service any vehicle that you want any relationship that you want to gain all you have to do is think about it and wish it into existence and it's, it was kind of funny because i was never a big proponent of that and actually when the person was telling me this it was my little brother we were plowing snow together he was telling me this. He was telling me it was something called The Secret, some kind of a book uh, that was written by somebody. I don't even know who wrote the book, but it's called The Secret. And The Secret is you just, I don't know, this is how people get famous. I guess rich and famous people know The Secret, like Will Smith type people. They know The uh, the Secret book and they know The Secret Code and they follow the, they follow the secret of positive thinking. And then they wish things into existence. So we're out plowing snow. It's late at night. We're in the 450. And my little brother's with me. And he's telling me this stuff. He's telling me, oh, all you have to do is wish it into it. And I'm listening. I'm thinking, man, I don't know. He's saying just wish it into existence. Just use your positive thinking. You can get whatever you want. And I'm like, okay. So... While you're telling me that you can wish anything into existence, I want you to wish into existence you plowing this lot right now. I'm, we're going to switch truck. We're going to switch seats. You're going to jump in the driver's seat of the F450. You're going to plow this lot. It was a big lot. You're going to plow this lot, and we're going to see how positive your thinking can be. Think positive and plow this lot. And he wasn't he wasn't that experienced yet, so. Uh, I, I was trying to train him is what I was trying to do. And I felt like when he was talking all this positive thinking stuff, I felt like he was talking a little crazy. So I really didn't have too much to say about it. I kind of got back at him a little and said, hey, yeah, you can be positive all you want, but you have to take action. You know, you have to do things. Yeah, being positive is definitely one of the ingredients. I mean, obviously, you can't not believe in yourself or whatever I mean you definitely have to start with some kind of a positive mindset it's definitely one of the ingredients but I was my position was maybe I'm wrong but my position was you have to take action you have to do things and think positive you know thinking positive is important but I mean if you're taking action you could be thinking negative as long as you're still taking action you could be scared and negative and still take action and still reach goals so being positive def is definitely a good thing, but it's not like I could sit here and uh, wish that I had the biggest snow account in the city forever and ever. And it'll never happen if I don't take action. I mean, I could get lucky to an extent for sure. It could just fall into my uh it could just fall into my uh, email inbox. Hey, we want you to service Kroger, you know. But I still have to take action. You know, I'm not going to service Kroger with just a pickup truck. I got to figure out what kind of machinery I'm going to put onto that property and all kinds of stuff. So there's limits. I mean, thinking positive is definitely one of the ingredients. But we're in this lot and I told him, hey, I need you to plow the lot. And he goes, well, I'm, I, I'm not ready. I don't know. But the thing is, like, listen, man, it's an empty lot. There's nothing here. It's a it's a rectangle. There's no obstacles. All you have to do is push the snow. As a matter of fact, I'm going to tell you where to push it. Just do it. And he goes, well, I can't see. I can't see over the steering wheel. And the truck is really too big. This, this is an F-450. It's too big. And I was like, well, what whatever happened to your positive thinking? Like, you literally just told me two minutes ago that you can do anything and as, as long as you think positive. And 
I told you that that kind of sounded like BS, but you know what? Maybe you were right. All you have to do is think positive and you can plow this lot. Just think positive, right? Like there's limitations to this, but something like that. I mean, you could probably think positive and probably do okay if you try. So he gets into the seat and I'm telling him every which way to plow and everything. And he's just so nervous that he just couldn't do it. I'm like, what happened to the positive thinking? But what's interesting about this is it made me really think about all of this. Because at the time when we were doing this, I was training him because I wanted him to get into the second truck and be able to plow with me. And I wanted him to be able to uh, run, basically run the truck. And we were going through a really tough time, though. It was just, it was a lot of storms where it was just me and him working. And it just came down to no help. Like, we had no help. And it was some tough nights. I mean, we would go out. This is like around... 2020 I believe that this happened I'm telling the story we go out and it's two of us and we're doing two trucks worth of work in one truck with two of us it was pretty tough it was pretty hard and I remember thinking like do I really think that the positive thinking will help no by itself no I mean it definitely is a benefit to have I guess you could say it could help you some but what I ended up thinking is like you need the positive thinking for sure it helps but you need to take action you know am I just sitting here thinking that my thoughts are gonna bring change because we need change like right now we need people you know right now we need people so in that moment, I thought like, hey, I need to do more than just positive thinking. I need to take action and I need to have some faith that I can pull this off and I can do this. So what would I do next? After that day when it was just us two, it was never just us two again after that. I figured it out. I figured out how to get some more people. How I did it, I can't necessarily say, but nonetheless, it was done. Like the number that was offered was aggressive and I ended up filling up both of both of the trucks I think uh, at that time yeah I reached out to a neighbor of mine that that uh, ended up taking one of the trucks and drove and I man I reached out to a ton of people just to fill every seat in the truck and after that, I mean, we barely skated by because after that, we got hit with some big storms, eight inches, you know, crazy snowfalls that if it was just the two of us, we would have been crushed. We would have definitely positive thinking wouldn't have helped with two guys in an eight in an eight, nine inch snowfall with not enough help. So, you know, if you follow the channel, you see me doing crazy stuff like I'll take the dumb trailer out all beautiful dump trailer all steel you would never want that thing to see salt or snow or any of those conditions and i'll take it out and put snow blowers in it because hey if that's going to move more snow blowers and that's what we're going to do we're going to get it done period we'll fill every seat in the truck and take out snow blowers take out this now maybe i this trailer this enclosed with so much money but maybe i'll freaking spray some uh fluid film on it and put like a rubber mat on the floor Maybe I'll take it out. I'm still kind of debating on how I'm going to play that with uh, how am I going to play that with this trailer being so nice and expensive and everything. But it is getting dinged up already. It kind of, you know, it's getting scratched. People drive by so wide. People drive by and tear it up. But yeah, maybe I'm going to throw some tires on this truck trailer because the, oh, the factory tires that come on these, even though it's brand new, it's like first year with this tr trailer the factory tires are so poor that they i wouldn't want to drive those these uh factory original tires they're already wearing kind of thin already just because they don't give you the best tires from the factory so i'm thinking put some meteor tires on it some meteor trailer tires on it and you could fit like five or six snowblowers in there you could fit more than that in here but five or six snowblowers in here 
truck full of guys and this is not positive thinking by itself i mean yeah i guess i'm thinking positive positive thinking is important but take an action i'm gonna have to take extreme action to fill these trucks and that's what i did and it was still hard it's still complicated we still had insane turnover where you hire you know what am i what am i doing am i hiring a guy no i'm hiring 10 people <laughs> it's crazy like right now you gotta hire 20 people so you got to put the word out there for 20, 25 people just to get like three guys. So that's what it takes, you know, extreme action. Positive thinking is a good thing, but uh, definitely not like, I don't know. Comment below and tell me what you guys think about the secret. Is there any secrets? I don't know if there is. But anyway, this is DS. See you guys in the next video. Hope to see you soon. I got to get to work. But please sub over and out.